So there's a current discussion right now in the Crankosa group uh, about e-bike mode and how e-bike mode has been uh, has dramatically changed. Like overnight, it used to be busy. You'll get a bunch of orders, and uh, and then the next day, it was just like, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Thank you. The next day, it was just like drastically just stopped. Uh, people were mentioning that they would probably get like one order like every other hour, a few hours. Some markets don't get none at all. So what happened? You know, people have different uh, theories of as to why that is. Um, and here's mine. I just thought about this earlier, and this is what makes sense to me. So e-bike is is fairly a new thing. I mean, not e-bikes, but e-bike mode in Uber Eats. It, it it's um this is something that Uber Eats just added because they would people would call and request it, right? And what I've noticed on e-bike mode is that a lot of deliveries were super far, like really like 10 miles. I mean, you would get a lot of them, but there were some that were very far away and they'll take you on, you know, the directions will tell you take you on the freeway and stuff like that. The pickups were very far away. For example, the restaurant will be like a mile, two miles away, pick up, and then there's still another five, seven, um, miles for the delivery and that's kind of like car mode when you think about it that's exactly the type of miles you'll get with deliveries and each each mode it's uh designed in a way that it's best for that vehicle like example for uber walking um they're not going to give you the same routes as a car they'll give you a delivery that's where a restaurant is like maybe a block away and the, the walk is only like a mile, right? Bike mode is, is a little bit more distance than that, but bike mode also is very limited. They're not gonna give you deliveries that are far away to pick up. They're gonna give you ones that are really close by and that don't have many miles, which is why you don't get that many pings because most deliveries uh, are probably not near you. I mean, there's only a handful of restaurants that you can be by that's like a, a like a, like a block radius, two block radius, right? So that's why walking mode and bike mode is really slow because of that, because of the way the algorithm algorithm is set up. So I think what happened with e-bike mode is that they basically fixed it. They fixed e-bike mode so it could be it could be like bike mode. In in Uber's mind, they fixed it, right? But for us who are operating e-bikes, we're used to all that business because we're getting deliveries that, you know, we don't have that uh, small window or that filter of deliveries, that small filter, or the filter that limits our deliveries. Because we'll get the ones that are far away, we'll be declining, 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 and then finally we'll get something that's like fairly, like that we're willing to do. But I think that's what happened. Uh, I think Uber Eats just fixed e-bike mode and they synchronized it with bike mode basically the same maybe just a little bit more miles than a regular bike but i think the whole thing about it being like the long distance deliveries is out so that means you're going to get a lot less deliveries like bike mode same thing with doordash same thing happened doordash uh i noticed that when i was on bike mode uh the delivery started getting more scarce less and less that's because the algorithm changed scooter mode once i finally added scooter mode because of the moped I was just getting deliveries nonstop, but they were far, far away. They were long deliveries, big orders too. Here's another thing, you know, that bike deliveries, you're gonna, you're not gonna get like massive deliveries. Uh, you'll get smaller ones, right? That's another thing they'll cut off. So I think that's the reason why e-bike now and moving forward is gonna suck. Can we do anything about it? Maybe we can all probably complain to Uber saying, hey, we're not getting deliveries. But that's my theory of what happened. I don't think anything got fucked up and i don't think they're prioritizing other vehicles it's just that the algorithm for e-bikes it's limited like bike mode i hope that makes sense but i think that's what happened let me know what your thoughts are on that